Hi, welcome to uh, number 45. So uh, I'm starting even later today. Uh, it's already like a 12 o'clock noon. So I hope I can finish this in about an hour because uh, I need to go out for my lunch. Okay. So uh, number 45, we are going to do a pyramid uh, count. So I have uh, six uh, exercises. The first one is the jump rope. So if you see, there's a 50, 100, 150, those are for the jump rope uh, reps, okay? Then the rest, we will just follow this uh, 5, 10, 15. Uh, we have kettlebell swings. Uh, yeah, the kettlebell swings, I'll just do a 5, 10, 15, and then 10 and 5. Uh, dive bombers and donkey kick, this is a body weight. Then I'm going to use, uh, oh, today you're going to use uh, a barbell and jump rope and kettlebell so those are the things that we need um, if you don't have a barbell just use uh, dumbbells or your sandbag okay um, so we have clean and press and then roll back and jump tuck and then bend over back roll so for the barbell exercises it's a little bit more simple because uh, I need to get some weight uh, exercise it's been um, I don't do much uh, weight so I think you know just getting some simple barbell weight exercise is good all right so as you can see the pyramid uh, works like this you start off with the low rep and then you go to the 10 rep and then 50 and then we come back down again so it's five rounds okay so make sure you have done your warm-up and uh, stretching so you think we can finish it in one hour <laughs> I hope so my only concern is that uh, dive bombs. Okay. Okay. So we're going to start off with the five and fifty jump ropes. Five reps and fifty jump ropes. It's up to you what style you want to do for your jump rope. So for me, I will do uh, alternate steps. So 12 kilos. Five swings. One, two, three, four, five. Next is the dive bombers and donkey kick. Uh, clean and press. Okay, stand close to your bar. Make sure your back is 
you're hinging at your hips and you're looking at the front okay use your hamstring and your glutes to lift the weight up one Four, five. This is a roll back jump tuck. Okay, hopefully I have space to roll from this way. So basically, this is the starting position. You're gonna. Roll. Squat down, roll back. Uh, okay, try to roll back and then get into a squat and then we do a jump tuck. One. Down again. We're gonna do a bend over back row. So your legs are um, hips apart, not too not too wide. So push your back back. This is the position. Keep your back straight. Don't uh, don't round your back or tuck your butt in. Just Hinge at your hips and then do a back row. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Okay. Maybe we should do one bend over back row, come back up again. Okay, never mind. Alright, so that's the first round. Now we go one more step up, which is the 10, 10 rep round. So back to your jump rope, 100 jumps. Dive bombers. And a donkey kick. One. 
one. Break it down to uh, sets of five so that you are able to you know take a break and maintain a good form. So five more to go. Last one. <sighs> Ten. You can see my shoulders and hips are getting unstable every time I do dive bombers. Ah. One side stronger than the other. Okay, next is the clean and press. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. for the low back jump up. Uh, and reps. <coughs> One. Two. Five more. Six. 
seven. Eight. How are you doing? We're gonna reach the peak now. 15 reps. Actually, I want to put 20. You know, like 5, 10, 15, 20, and then 15, 10, 5. But I have a feeling I don't have that much time. <laughs> It'll take me probably more than an hour to do that. Okay. All right. Shall we continue? 150 jump ropes. Okay. Dive bombers. <clears throat> How about we do a set of five? One. Two. 
before. Five. So when you do the donkey kick, I want you to engage your your core so that you can actually, you know, there will be a few seconds. You actually your core is actually uh, stabilizing your donkey kick. Okay. Okay, all right, five more, it's really damn hot here. <laughs> Five more. Okay, let's continue. One. Two. Three. Oh. Two more. To do it with form, maintain your maintain your form. <sighs> Fourteen. Fifteen. Ah, oh, I can feel the. Arms tired, getting tired. Okay, now it's uh, clean and press. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Ten. Okay. Five more to go.
one. Two. Three. This is the rollback. fun but it's a uh, it's very cardio <laughs> Seven, eight, nine, oh, ten. Oh my god! I'm trying to hold on to this. It's okay to take a break if you are. Running out of breath. Okay. Ready? Last five. Try not to use your hands when you roll back to the squat and then do a cut jump. Otherwise, you can always use your, bend, your hands to assist you. And then pause and then you do a jump tuck. If you can do the jump tuck then just do a jump, okay? Oh, 11. Throw. 13. 14. So now we're going downhill. We have reached the peak. Two more rounds. Oh, yeah. I'm such a sweat mess you now. Okay. You know what's the 
temperature here is about uh, 36, 37. <sighs> okay. Five moments. My weakness in the dive bombers is uh, when my hips come down, it comes down too fast. Uh, I'm trying to control the abs, and then of course, my it also means my shoulder is not strong enough to support it as it you know as it descends. Okay, so. Another five more to go. If you can do a better dive bomber, let me know how you do it. I've been trying to learn this dive bomber as well for a long time.
Now it's a little bit angel tuck. Okay, five more to go. Okay, so that's a uh, yeah, ten. Now it's a uh, bend over back row. Get up. Thank you. 
one more round. Last round is a power press. I'm happy, are you? <laughs> okay, let's finish it and try to take lesser breaks. Well, for me, at least. This is a clean and press. one almost uh, 43 minutes so how do you feel do you 
clear it out of you know your can't breathe just walk around try to bring down your heart rate before you actually sit down and rest okay okay all right so i hope you enjoyed this uh number 45 you know let me know if uh uh, you'd like to see more of any exercises or you have any comments on my exercises so far okay so let's make sure you know the last time I carry I, I used the barbell and weights I actually sprained my back so that's why I don't dare to be well I'm I don't uh, want to do too many combos uh, you know with the weight exercise um, so that's why it's a little bit more straightforward for the barbell Okay, alright, so I hope you enjoy this workout. Make sure you, you do it in good form. Be safe, don't push it. I know that last round, the five reps, you tend to rush into it because it's the last round and it's only five reps. Um, but whatever it is, just make every rep count. Do it properly. Make sure you know what you're doing and which muscle you're working. And I'm pretty sure you'll see your results pretty fast. Okay, alright, thank you, and I'll see you next week then. Bye.